Hey everybody, Scott Burnett here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video. Today, we hit a thousand subscribers last night at 11.45. My son, Ryan Burnett, was the guy. <laughs> he popped over to another Gmail and wham, 1,000. Woke me up and told me. Uh, it's awesome. He's on a three hour time delay. So it's kind of... So we are at 1,002 subscribers. We need to do a giveaway. I'm trying to come up with a good idea, something fun, and something where I can do something nice for somebody. But today's video, I'm on my lunch break, and I need to create a Windows 10 install disk, a, a USB disk. So I've got a, a little USB drive. This was actually a 32 gig. You can buy these things really cheap now too. Um, I'm going to put it in my computer over here and I'm going to share a screen. It's really easy if you have to build a Windows 10 or Windows 11 disk to reinstall or add features or repair your system. I'm going to show you how to do it. So you need a USB drive at least 8 gigs or bigger. Uh, it helps to have a USB 3, which most all computers now have a USB 3. Uh, port so let me go over here to the computer show you what we got and um, very simple so let me capture my screen start recording and go alright so what you have to do you have to search for Windows media creation tool and I generally pick the one is 21H2 because that's the Windows 10 um, that I use that we use at work and everything so here's our Windows 10 and there's going to be links in the description for all this so I'm going to download the tool and this is a media creation tool 21H2 now the Windows 11 is the 21H2 or 22H2, I think. I'll have to verify that. Uh, so we're going to open. And we'll say yes. And uh, what it'll do, it'll start downloading the file after you tell it to. So we got to go through a couple of things here. I've got my drive in here. Now, make sure you use a drive that doesn't have anything on it that you want to keep because it's going to wipe it. So, so I'll speed you through this. All right, we're going to accept all the uh, Lula, Lula terms and conditions. Oh, you do need a Windows computer to do this. So, I don't know if you can do it on Mac or not. I'm, I don't think you can, but I don't know. But you can also use this to download to a DVD as well. So you can create an ISO file. So you can either upgrade this PC or you can create an installation media. I'm going to create an installation media. Um, we'll use 64 bit, Windows 10, English language. You can pick whatever you want there, just as long as you know what you're doing. Hit next. USB flash drive at least 8 gigs, or you can save it as an ISO file. I'm going to use USB drive. There's my D untitled. Hit next. Now what it's going to do, it's going to sit there and build your drive for you. And then you can get you a label maker. You can be a real nerd. Oop. Get you a label maker, label it. Because <laughs> I am a nerd. So... I'm a big nerd though, so. so let's, uh, we'll let it go through this and we'll come right back. Hey, while we're doing this, go ahead and subscribe to the channel. Hit that like button. Leave me a comment. Do you use Windows, Mac, Linux? What do you use? I use all of them, so. Um, sitting here having my coffee, the lunch, uh, I don't know. 
Okay, so it's verifying the download. And it's just making sure that all the files are there and the checksums are good and all that stuff. So Then once you get this done, you can take it to whatever computer you want to reload or refresh or whatever, stick it in there and run it and pray to, pray to the good Lord and hopefully it works. Windows is just kind of a roll the dice anyway, so. Hey, and while we're doing this, I have an Instagram and a Facebook. If y'all want to stop over there, there'll be links pop up here on it. Uh, y'all can see what I post. I post a lot about videos and a lot about the dog and blueberries and stuff like that. Hadn't been fishing in a while, so I'm not posting anything about fishing, so. Too dang hot. Okay, so now it says your USB flash drive is ready. Took about five or six minutes to do that. Hit finish and a little clean up and then I'll close that down and we'll look at it here on my... So there's all the files it takes to install Windows. So now you will, once you get done with your machine, you'll have to put drivers and make sure your antivirus and updates and all that up to, up to speed. But that will do it right there. Um, hope everybody enjoys this video. If you get anything out of it, I'm just tickled to death. Um, make sure you hit that like button. If you like this kind of content, leave me a comment down in, in the bottom. If you have any questions, leave me a question. I answer every one of them. Um, hope everybody's doing well today. Hope everybody's having a great week. And until the next video, thanks. Oh, subscribe to the channel. Subscribe to the channel. And then have a good day. See ya.